Announcing page filters for mobile, this will enable users who are on the go looking to tell a story or discover insights at the page level where the cards are all grouped together to filter in a quick and intuitive experience. Once a user navigates to any page, they can tap into the menu and trigger page filters. Here, you'll see the newly released action sheet where you can tap to add the filter. I'll tap in to select the category. Here we can see we're dealing with a big list, so I'll resize the sheet to have more room to consume. From here, users can either scroll to find what they want or search. I'll use search. I'll type in the category I want to filter on, which is applicant status. Here it is. For those advanced users, they can actually see which and how many data sets this column applies to by tapping the chevron. Once open, they can modify which ones it will apply to. For this example, we want them all selected, so we will go ahead and move on. I'll tap next to select the operator. Here I can see both the icon and operator written out so it is clear what I am doing. I want is selected, so we're good. Now I'll select which value I want to filter on. Here I am seeing all the available results, which are the statuses we are using. I want to filter to just see our applicants in an open status, so I'll select open. Now all I need to do is select apply. Taking a look at the page, we can easily see the page has been filtered by applicant status showing those which are open. Users can identify cards which have been filtered by seeing the green filter icon on the bottom right of each card. Users will also see a green banner at the bottom of the page anytime filters are applied, so they can trust the data understanding that the original view has been modified. I can easily tap the banner to go back into the filters to modify or add a new one. Users can also toggle off, delete, or add a new filter like so. Just like you'd expect, Filters a user creates will save and persist through sessions specific to that user so they can customize the experience just for them. And there you have it, mobile page filters.